to the young people of Nigeria on the progress of that high-level working group, including the other committee that was recently created, uh, which is the uh, steering committee for the presidential engagement with all our aspirants, which will now focus on the presidential candidate of our party. We want to be able to know what the candidate of our party that emerges from the primary would have for with the youth of Nigeria. And so there are different activities that we have introduced in the youth wing to ensure that we can begin to mainstream the voices of young people of our party and make sure that the youth of this party are not taken for granted. You will recall my speech at the house of, uh, at, at the Asso Rock Villa in the prayer high level working group, which is to bring together young people of our party who are in very senior positions, like even Zakari Ahmed, who is the essay to the president on infrastructure, to use their influence, their powers, and their connection and their access to be able to pave way for other young people in public office. So one of the things that we have done, which the uh, chairperson of the committee will be really now, is to begin to engage policymakers and lobby for positions directly from the power brokers in the state, including governors of some state and other power brokers to ensure that we can increase the participation of young people. And I'm delighted at the progress that they have made, which engineer Sally Ijo Ahmed is going to be really now to us here. And so the purpose of this gathering is for them to give an account. The fact that he has been able to secure a 50% discount for all young people uh, aspiring to positions uh, in 2023 ele uh, elections, I think is an incredible achievement. So it's with that in mind that we're trying to come in to support him. When I got a call from him uh, on the 1st of May that he was constituting this group, I was very, very excited to hear the kind of young people he has brought together so that we are able to work all as a group, mainstream all our activities to ensure that young aspirants are uh, are going to come in and be extremely influential in these coming elections. Not just that, beyond looking at that, how have we been involved in the primary elections? How are we going to be involved during the general elections? And how are we going to also be involved after uh, being elected to office? So as uh, the youth leader has mentioned, you know, we have been able to engage a few governors. We have engaged with uh, the governor of Lagos State, governor of Ogun State, Governor of uh, Kogi State, Governor of Ekiti State, mm -hmm. and we have all gotten very, very firm commitment from these governors. Already they have shown a lot of encouragement because once you look through their cabinets, you find that a lot of the people that they are currently bringing into their cabinets are spanning into young uh, uh, people between commissioners. <laughs>